hurricane. <laughs> Ahoy there, everyone, and welcome aboard. I'll be your Captain Hillian today, along with... Peace and mighty Lieutenant Rakir at your service, along with... Along with... <laughs> Gunnery <laughs> made rum, and yes, I actually do, in fact, have finally gotten around to getting geared up for this mission. Yeah, and welcome back to Alien Isolation, where last time, uh, well, we set the... Well, we didn't set the place on the fire, but it is burning now. So, yeah, as if Sevastopol didn't have enough problems already. On the, uh, yeah, on the upside, we have a flamethrower now. Yeah. Oh, dear. Okay, now, I thought, for a second there, I thought I, sm I smelled something, but that's probably from when I accidentally smoke-bombed the, the house earlier. Uh, yeah, yeah to tell your mom that if that anytime she wants to hide her snacks, she shouldn't use a place that people set on fire. Yeah, for, for context, uh, <clears throat> uh, again with the fuck, it's that his, <clears throat> uh, for dinner, uh, it was my turn to make dinner, and I picked up one of those uh, easy-to-make kits. It's just with the, most of the ingredients, except for easily perishable ones, in the simple instructions for shepherd's pie this time, which well was for the oven. And uh, yeah, apparently she'd hidden a bag of uh, chips in the oven, and well, since she was helping me out, uh, she set the ov oven without checking inside because we rarely use the thing outside of a hiding spot, apparently. So and I uh, yeah. She wait. So she was the one burning her own chips. Yep. Oh dear. So, yeah, we only found out about that. Well, off <laughs> by opening the damn thing and smoke bombing the kitchen. Uh, it didn't set off the alarms, though, luckily. <clears throat> yeah, uh, people... I know many people do sometimes use the ovens as a storage unit. Including the place you should not use as a storage unit. Yep. But I recommend against it for... Exactly we just been off that one time someone forgets... Or someone's unaware, like... Like, I think I heard a, a VTuber where they all the family knew, except uh, uh, except one of their sisters had forgo completely forgotten about visiting, and turn on the oven, where a lot of plastic objects were laying inside. Yeah, I all think, it melted. Yeah. I think something might be glitching, because I, it sounds like something is being knocked around or something. Also, he's refusing to move. You just throw the noisemaker and let Greg kill him. That is partially what I'm hoping um, for, but it just lured a sec. No, it lured all of them over. I guess I could throw a pipe bomb or something. Actually, no, there he is. That would have been a perfect moment to flashbang all three of them. That was a heavy thud. And now he's just back there. Go right. Pop between a fucking xenomorph and a bunch of twitchy gun toting loons. And. Yeah. It... God. Okay, that <laughs> that's too much noise. It, it... What the uh, fuck? It, I'm lo I'm locked in. I'm I'm blocked in now. What the heck? Do boom. Now, the... now take the lift. I'm sorry, does he just not see you? Okay, he does- he was killing the Xenomorph, RUN! Yep. Yep. <sighs> WHY?! <laughs> I'm trying to grab the flamethrower because I would not have been able to get away in any, any circumstance there. But- <laughs> I- I guess that guy got his revenge indirectly. <laughs> what just happened? I was too 
minutes in a row we had some very interesting start, I would say. <laughs> Just the church yeah. and you know what? Fuck it, clip it. I hope that I hope that got caught in the clip window there, but <laughs> that was that was a new one. Uh, but yeah, to finish up on the the, the shepherd's pie, the, honestly, it's more closer to uh, cottage pie because apparently the difference is whether you use lamb, mutton, or beef, with it being cottage in the case of the latter. Uh, yeah, that turned out to be really good, actually. So I'll be uh, making that again sometime. I guess you put the pie in after you smoked the room, uh, smoked out the room. For me, oh, I don't think it would be edible you put in the pie along with the smoke bomb the ships. Yeah, we we of course pulled those out and put it on a different tray. It, uh, uh, okay, he went down quite easily. And now they're shooting at the Cedar March, so Flamestar orders no, shooting at you. Shooting at, which apparently isn't getting Greg's attention. <laughs> uh, it is. Uh, um, flame star. fucking course. <laughs> Uh, Maybe we should make a death counter over how many times you've been killed by Greg. Uh, maybe. I, we're at least on six, I think. At, at least for the comical ones for, yeah, he did hear you. Also, fun fact, this game actually does have voice recognition, but it's only on the console versions. Okay. So, so I can no be worry. as loud as I want, technically. Yes. And Greg won't hear you. Okay, well, that's <laughs> one mystery solved. He won't hear that either, Gesundheit. Bless you. Oh, so, something I need to commentate here. I, I noticed there's a funny part in here. Let's see. Captain is a vampire at the moment, correct? Uh, yes. Nothing specific. Just a vampire. Alright, and I'm a xenomorph. Yes. And Rome is a human. Yes. What does a uh, xenomorph and vampire have in common? They rip their victims apart. Uh, I was to say, humans own all on the diet. Ah. Well, I guess it's a good thing I brought a gun. <laughs> Okay, he's heading that way. Yeah, I. I th oh, oh, one of them must have shot him. Or some, yeah. God. Okay, he's heading flame away. Door. Have it set already. Have the flamethrower set already. <laughs> there he is. I just spotted. Yep. He spotted the dickhead's dickhead. <laughs> I'll be right back. I need to get a need to do a thing and then order food. Okay. Uh, let's see. Alright, uh, the dongle thingy is inserted oh. properly, right? I I didn't actually think we'd have we'd need to find this one. Or is it a different one that we uh, no, that's the right one, okay. <laughs> Alright. Here I here I thought we'd have to sneak around as a bucker. Uh, it sounds like this entire decommissioning on its own has just been an absolute shit show. We, almost random systems being pulled apart, and Greg's already here from the sounds of it. Yeah. Like, it's obviously so out there it needs to be decommissioned, just handled very badly and bad timing. You hostile or just okay? No, you are just done with life. This it really seems. doesn't feel right, does it? Okay. 
cozy. Okay. Let, let, let me turn back a bit and actually look what's in that other area. Also, you seriously should consider just getting the hell out of here. For a moment, I thought he was behind those doors. And okay, there is enough. There is no other way here. Okay, I thought one of these was green, but nope. Okay then. That's the vents. Uh. Yeah, when he's in the vents, it we are generally safer. But it does mean he can pop out anywhere. I'm back. Timing. <laughs> hey, you're not dead. Yet. I'm not yet. Net. Yeah, not dead yet, or however that Monty Python song goes. I'm not yet dead. I can dance and I can sing. I'm not yet dead. I can do the Highland Fling. One second. <laughs> Even Ripley's getting sick of him, <laughs> of him piping in. Oh dear! And also, I never heard that song. <laughs> okay, remind me to just link it to you in an after stream then. Oop. Yeah, I can look it up later. Oop. Oop. Camera. Okay. I'd rather not find out what happens if we get caught by those. It's probably going to be very loud. Also, yoink. Okay. First, let me actually look here. Mm -hmm. What do we have? Only one spot. Only an unstable system. Don't really know yet what unstable system means, but I'm presuming it's something that could explode. Speaking of, let me actually check where the fuck that is. Okay, that's across the room about. Somewhere well, where the sparking is, probably. Okay. Now, let's just quickly cut this. Okay. There and there. Okay, I like that it actually takes a bit of time for that yeah, for it to cool down. Because well it is a freaking plasma torch that we're putting against it. Come on. Oh god, that's Unsettling. Uh, we're, we're, we're fine. We're fine. Okay, I was honestly expecting him to pipe up. Uh, you're not allowed to be here and such. Uh, seeks and funding. Seeks and Rocket to inform that Gemini exp extra plan solutions will receive no further funding. Seeks is not liable for time remaining on Gemini personnel contracts. Fuck. Okay, when they say that, it's Greg. Wait, what? Ha hazard containment breach log, that's them talking oh. about. Come on. Uh, please talk to your line manager about the facility shut down. Take the thank you. Uh, after a discussion with the line manager, okay, 8897. Should the power be uh, required in distribution? Da, 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 da. Okay. I think we needed to do that to lure. It's 
not the kind of caretake I was hoping for. I think we need to do that to lure to lure the working Joe out. Yeah, because he's not here. Okay. He's in front of that. Okay, no, that means he's likely in that little He's over there. And we just opened the door to him. <laughs> He's pissed off. Okay. There. Mm -hmm. Surplus to requirements. This re yeah, the problem is surplus to requirements will be decommissioned shortly. We're reducing the power budget. Yeah. Yep. I keep doing that expecting I'm... Because it's... There. Okay. Reinstate. Yes. I see one in the analysis labs, the others in the decontamination room. Quickly grabbing that. It looks like the working Joe is just going to stick to the other spots. Okay, now the place is open again. Okay, this might be a bad idea if they're up here. So, okay, door locked. Is he finally coming back? Yes. Really? I do wonder if they'll actually re respond to the sounds of things getting knocked around. Don't, don't tell me I've just trapped myself here. Okay, no, I haven't. Bye bye. Now I have this stupid idea of if putting wigs of welcome back, if putting wigs on the Joes would make them look better or worse. Yes. Uh, fun fact, there's actually uh, a combat model of the working Joes. Of course. Oh, yes. They're uh, your co-op players if you're playing solo in Alien Fire Team Elite and also try to shoot you because some of them were used by Will and Jitani. Oh, you yeah, meant in course. this game? In other no, game. In, oh. in, other, in another game, in Aliens Fire Team Elite. Okay. That I do not The same point. In a very open area. Yeah, I know okay. of the, the battle uh, synthetics from, uh, the, from here, from videos of them telling of them being in the comics and other the games. Okay, I think so there's I saw also... that. Oh, go ahead. I think there's also Whale and Yutani made synthetics for combat from yeah. Aliens vs. Predator. I also remember the Xenoborgs, you know. They tried to make a Xeno they tried to make a Xenomorph into like they give it plasma rifles and such, and it basically meant it just became a stationary turret. Okay. And apparently I was I thought the save station wouldn't function with hostiles nearby, but it just said, well, hostiles nearby and it still let me use it. So that's it one myth bunk. It's, it's more, bunk if you use it while there are hostiles nearby, there's a good chance you'll die midway through the attempted save. Yeah. Yeah, so be careful. Also, drone reminded me of something a bit more weird. I did. From the one of the older comics, I think. You are but there were a hybrid of xenomorphs and synthetics. Okay, that's uh, new. Yeah, 
I saw a picture of uh, all I can think of is how sense. Yeah, this was sort of like the from the games uh, Roms uh, talked about. For I seen those. This was actually hybrid between a xenomorph and synthetic, and I couldn't get my head around it. For sense, how did happen? Synthetics are not organic. Now they can use. Now they probably have organic com uh, compounds at the very least. And, well, they can use iron to freaking eat, so I guess if there's enough stuff that they can actually use... Didn't they say I could climb in here earlier? Yeah, but here's the thing. Xenomorphs never infect a synthetic because they can't use them. Hmm. Must have been a more organic version or something. Honestly, yeah. my maybe money. just a face hugger that was forced to. Probably. Also, Greg's on the vents again. Now he just came out, I think. And also, yes, I missed Rom again. I thought it said Greg is on the bends again. <laughs> wait, 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 what does that mean again? When people say that. Like, uh, typically, when you say someone has the bends, it means they have diarrhea, and I don't think any of <laughs> us would want to see how that would look with a xenomorph. Wait, that's what people mean? Yes, I, I think you misunderstood. Uh, well, doubly, yeah, so. Uh, though I'm not sure what other thing may have been applicable. Yeah, I heard the term thrown about here and now and then, but I thought it was something else, like uh, oh, they go insane and such. Not that. Not not sure what saying on the X or Y might have actually been, but. I think we're just going to keep focusing on, well, not getting eaten. Probably a good idea. I'm, I'm still surprised that they're making a new game. Like, this is not the first time we spoke about, oh, how fun it would be if they make a remake or something like that, a new game. Yeah, oh, they made a not... sequel. Yeah, only to make a damn sequel or a remake on the very same evening after the stream, me stream, or the very next day or week. Yeah. Ah, uh, timing. Uh, also, apparently there's a new uh, Tomb Raider series on Netflix. Yeah. Apparently. Some I, I saw one funny about it. I've seen people already angry about it. Something about they made Lara Croft Tomb masculine or something they always yeah. bitch about that at this point yeah i just felt like i'm not gonna trust it if all they knew they could have tampered themselves with the picture and just to spread a lie for all i know the picture show uh, may have been fake for all i know yeah like it likely is i don't know i just don't have it in me to care yeah i, I may give it a watch to see if it's good for oh damn it Mystery if they there. still capture lara croft's Personality and all that. I mean, actually, personality, not this line for the bosom. I talk about actual persona. I'll be happy. The thing is, there's like at least three different Lara Crofts, remember? Yeah. Oh, right. And now I just have the dumb idea of how Laura would look like and play like in a persona game. <laughs> oh, no. Uh, just look, because of that, I hear ambulance outside. Okay. Also, I just had a... Also, when you said... When you, also, you just reminded me of the old... fucking Sailor Moon dub gag. Basically. Uh, yeah. Okay, so one of, the, one of the early Sailor Moon uh, dubs, they had a bit where they're, like, playing Snow White. And... They say they, and the sailor says you're going that they have the best talent. It says they say as they, they prominently show their breasts. Uh. 
and honestly, and I find that funny just because of how they're like trying to hide that it's a press joke, and later and later ones just went and said, "Nah, no, nah, it's a press joke." Like they literally even say they straight up say it on later on um, on later dubs. This has got to be a bad dream. I, yeah. I, I suspect it's it's part of original uh, translation as well, since. Yeah. Japan tends to be a lot looser with stuff like that. Yeah, and though at the same time, I will eternally find it funny that they made the one very explicit lesbian relationship into an incestuous lesbian relationship because they referred to them as cousins and did absolutely nothing fucking else. Yeah, that. Uh, Japan and you see have their own issues. Like Japan have a lot of issues, also, but they have been a bit more in animation at least, more open to uh, uh, people of other sexualities compared to USA in the past. Which oh, is a good example on. with Silly Moon. This was just... Uh... Oh, come on! <laughs> okay, good thing I went for the save station then, huh? And yeah, well, we yeah. now know what happens if the camera sees you. Yeah, it gets annoyingly uh, loud. Uh, yeah. Bye, yeah, people. Lesbian relationships is fine. That's good. I, 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 I applaud them for doing that in Japan. But what you say did, I... I cannot forgive that. That's... Uh, the, the funny it, thing is that they probably uh, didn't even know they... Well, they obvious, if they'd known, they would have definitely changed things. But it's very clear that they didn't watch the entirety of the series they had on their hands when they made that change. Yeah, for so they only had themselves thought, to blame for not binging it. Yeah, for and for no, they were aware of it, but they were against it. You know, back in the day, that kind of thing was a no-no yeah. for American TV, and they changed it to something. Yeah, they, ac they accidentally so changed it. Gross. <laughs> yeah, and I phrased that out, from wholesome to gross. The Tomb Raider Come stuff. the fuck on, I'm hiding behind. Hey, some of the Tomb Raider stuff is on sale. Okay, did that? Nope, that... Nope, it got you. Oh, no. Right, hmm. yeah, just to repeat for people to understand. Lesbians, fine, that's good. Incest, no. No. Yeah. That was Incest, cost never good. Incest, never literally... good. Sorry, yeah, on. I love how they just cost it by a fumble in translation. Yeah. Also, uh, some of the Tomb Raider stuff is on sale, including the Survivor Trilogy, I'm guessing. And mm. some of the stuff for, like, Temple of Osiris and Guardian of Light. You know, okay, so now would, be the be now would it be the best time those. to buy those for possible co-op streams, then? Yeah, except I'm broke. Okay. Hmm. I wish I could do Left 4 Dead co-op, but the problem is we get some asshole just crashed in simply because. Yeah. I, I, I get, I'm pretty sure I had set it, you know, set it to friends only, so yeah, some fuckery was going on with that. Yeah. Yeah, and they probably not uh, updated security for that game for a damn long time, so. Yeah. One second, like I'm getting a phone call. Okay. Right? Hmm. Already got those. Uh, let's see. Okay, it's in the. Next room over, quickest way is through the vents, or whatever, this, this conveyor belt, or whatever. Uh, I still can't get over after learning the info about the Seal Moon thing, translation <laughs> error, just... It just boggles me of... Again, they, they didn't know that they... I, I'm, I'm completely convinced that they didn't you know, watch the entire uh, thing to, well, not step into it like that. So they just rush things and, well, cause their own problem. Is that... Yeah, as it is. 
if they even redub it, I hope they redub it proper. They've been doing redubs for like a few years now. All right, so they have uh, some dubs that are actually more true to original uh, translation then, I guess. Yeah. But there are cases where the changes make a bit more sense of that. Like, I think in Evangelion, they... In Japanese, they use children as both a pronoun and as both um, to refer to both multiple and a singular person. Okay. In English, in order to make it, you know, make coherent sense, the translator basically had to go had to fight just so they could use the word child, so anytime they refer to the pilots, who are referred to as children, make actual coherent sense in English. Uh, okay, as in a contextual sense. Yeah, basically like, they refer to a specific pilot that would be, chi that would be insert number child. Well, if they refer to all of the pilots, they refer to children. Oh, yeah, that makes sense for, again, that would be a contextual translation. Yeah. There's also another one where I remember the angels who were originally called messengers. But since, you know, angels are messengers of God and all that. No, wait, angels were... No, wait, it wasn't messengers. I don't remember well, actually. But I do remember the angels were called a different thing. Apostles. There were apostles in in the original translation, but became angels in the English translation, and that one just stuck. If I remember correctly, Rebel had it changed. So, or was it Rebel? No, I think Rebel stuck to the whole children child thing, while the redub in Netflix is the one that changed it to the more how it was originally. Uh, okay. I got the so it became eight, eight, nine, seven, so it became it children for specific one and children for all. If that makes. Okay. Mm -hmm. All right. And security Deposit locker. All. Okay. Twenty-seven forty-three. We're going to have to find a way to get uh, the goods into Sevastopol. Waits his uh, commercial cargo under scrutiny at the moment, and he's checking the ambulance shuttles. Tell your man outside to sit tight for now. I know a guy called Sinclair who could help us. I remember when the marshals actually had to deal with real crime rather than harassing businessmen and screwing with their deals. Okay. <clears throat> oh, let me guess. That's the one for this one. Okay. Two, seven, four, three. Blasting cap. Ion torch, okay. Oh, there he is. I wonder if he actually reacts to doors opening. The question. Oh boy. Fucking oh, perfect. Shoot him. Oh, come on. Okay, I'm guessing you have to shoot him when it sees you so that it fucks off. Actually, that's a f another thing I think I need to tell you. Yeah. Mm. If you use the flavor too much against him, yeah. Greg will learn how to handle it. Ooh, bit of a glitch there. But I haven't used it that much against him, at least not without dying in between. And that shouldn't carry over. They really wanted that shot. Uh, Alright, yeah, we need to find the password before we can insert it. Good game design so people can't cheat it. 
Speedrunners probably hate that, though. Yeah, probably. That reminds me, apparently it, apparently with Papers, Please, there is one character that Speedrunners hate for a uh, infractionless speedruns. And that's the fucker who keeps showing up again and again and again. Oh, Georgie. At one point, yeah, at one point, uh, no matter what you do, you're going to get uh, an infraction on it. There. Who? He's yeah, the guy I... who cho who literally shows up and basically he starts out with no passport, then gives you oh. a passport made of that's been written with crayon. Then yeah. immediately tells you he's bringing drugs into the country. Then brings you a, a more re realistic passport, but it's still from a country that doesn't exist, like the one with made out of crayons. And he seems oddly fine with all of this because he's oddly joyful. Yeah, apparently he's called Mr. Persistent in the code. <laughs> Okay, I forgot. I didn't know. I think I forgot that there was this name. I'm used to him being called another name. What a knowing motherfucker. Mr. Potato. <laughs> okay. <laughs> like Mr. Potato Head? No, not Potato Head, just Potato. I was Jack Seven guy playing the game. Uh. And that was his nickname for him Mr. Potato. I should watch some of his stuff again sometime, because I haven't watched anything from Jack in... Years? At least months, possibly years. Yeah, it, there seems to be a bit active again. Hmm, pardon? But yeah, there would be some games I'd be willing to watch a bit again. Hmm. But I mean, uh, less active since so they're actually trying to take care of their health. The only way through it is covered in blood. That's nice. Let's pull this quick. Lovely. Okay, where's the next one? Down there somewhere. I'm probably going to regret this. Did someone crawl in here or get dragged in here? Probably Somebody got seems. dragged in here. Let's see, we'll take your flame for our fuel. I'm guessing we aren't actually finding flame for our fuel on everyone, but more like combustible fluids and such that can be used as. Maybe? It Correctly, the one in Aliens is like a makeshift flame. The one in the first Alien movie is a makeshift flame star, and this one's based on that one, so yeah, that probably makes sense. Yeah. <laughs> I think that guy actually crawled in there himself and died there from his wounds. Yeah. Hmm. Probably got, well, slashed by Greg or maybe something by someone else. Also, I'm taking a bit of a risk here to just quickly make one of these. There. I should probably try to keep up at the maximum of those. Also, I don't like that we can't look down. I just had a brilliant idea. A bit yeah. evil, but brilliant. We should insert a certain... a few songs into those uh, noisemakers. <laughs> like Baby Shark. Okay, let's not go that evil. <laughs> I was gonna go with the Let It Go. But... Baby Shark, really? What the heck? No need to be that evil. And that, the thing. I, I know that song since I was a tiny kid. Fuck this up there. It's a very old song. And the original, and we sang the original version. This is, uh, uh, I guess, not child friendly to Americans. Most likely. Uh, for King of the context, the original song is basically Marby Shark, Daddy Shark, Children Sharks go up and bite some people's legs off. Okay. And a lot of blood. So, yeah, I think you can see what I mean. Uh, mean. For what little I heard of the Baby Shark nowadays, it sounds like a very short-term, repetitive 
censored version. Yeah, it's like basically any... I wouldn't even call them modern nursery rhymes, more like ditties or something. I... Fuck. I thought he was away. It's a good thing Amanda's eyes are apparently on a telescope in front of her. Yeah. Is he just going to be stalking around here now? What about the heck the tubes are for? It's probably fuel or something in those. I think he's figured out that his movement can be sensed or something. Okay, while he's on the other side of this. I hope that it wasn't a dumb move or something. I'm guessing the working Joe is programmed with how to get it working or something? Oop. For a second I didn't see him even though he was staring blankly towards me. Okay, yeah, he does the rest, it seems. Okay. Rag seems to have vanished somewhere. Okay, that doesn't look safe. <laughs> uh. Still some lingering smoke around here. Okay, is this what's supposed to be going on, or...? Initialized di distribution conduits. I think that is what we started here. Hmm. Okay, Joe is busy with that. That other one is... I'm 100% certain they're faking it. As much as an android can fake something. Is there anything else we need to do around here? Oh, that's probably. Oh, I, we need to troubleshoot this thing as he keeps trying to do it over and over again. Check. Okay, I'm hoping this connects to where we need to go. Welcome back. I Welcome think back. Just landed no, I was I was already here. I just was typing something, but the uh, keyboard blocked me. Ah. Okay. Over Wait, there keyboard somewhere. blocked you? How big is your keyboard? Right now, the keyboard didn't block me. The microphone blocked me. Okay, that makes more sense. Wait, how big is the microphone? It's not the microphone, it's the wire. Okay, you went that way. I, just because you said, I didn't realize my microphone is on the wrong side of me. There we go. Now it's in front of me again. I probably should. I 
I probably oh, no, should readjust it or I'm holding my uh, mic sometime because it's not entirely directly in front of me, I think. Uh, uh, mine is just as the table. Right. You said moved it away aside for I wanted to clean something off the disk and if I heard something from Discord, it, my mic was always blocking me for see whoever said something in the pop up. Set the fucking door. Unless I was sat by the PC, but uh, again, usually when I'm laying in bed, I hear a pop up, look over and see. Yeah, a pop up. I can't see who uh, wrote the pop up. Okay, I just barely dodged him there, I think. That's blocking the it, way. You'll be fine. Also, I don't forget, I have investigated about the Dino Crisis thing. Apparently, there was a, a, a half clickbait, was more of a person wanted them to do a remake. But they admitted that early on that it was uh, clickbaited. Okay. However, they. The, oh, fun remake that is about to release. Okay, that's good news at least. Oh yeah, and also been some other rebirth patches of the original, I guess. That's a recent come out uh, to make uh, the old version more stable and all that, I guess. Okay, something's mucking up here. Okay, that's... I've had enough smoke for today, so let's get rid of this. Okay. Let's... Okay, I think he's still in the vents. Taking a quick check up here. Oh, no longer in the vents. Ah, good thing I did. Okay, I just hope he doesn't come walking up here. He's coming up. I think that was him jumping back into the vents. Doesn't mean he isn't coming up. <laughs> Told you. I thought it was behind here, not in front. Okay, yeah, that was a close call. Holy... Don't know where that leads to. It probably leads back to where we were before. But I'm just heading this way instead. It's probably oh, a no. quick way out. No, I have a song stuck in my head. Hmm? An old classic one from the uh, this era, actually, oh, uh, for the era of the original, at least. Uh, let's see. I think the title is mm -hmm. "Feel Like Somebody's Watching Me." Yeah, oh, that one. I always feel like. Somebody's <laughs> watching me. <laughs> Fuck you. <laughs> Fuck you, Greg. <laughs> <laughs> me. You, maybe, me, you all started to do that song. Greg heard Greg arrived. Oh. And I made it. <laughs> it could have been oh, worse. Yeah. I could have been thinking, let's all go to the lobby oh, and Greg tries to kill us all. Yeah, he's yeah. grabbing a snack. Also, hello in chat, Mettler. How are you doing today? Uh, how how's the hide and seek with the aliens? So far we've been caught two or three times. <laughs> oh, we're gonna make a dream. Hill is gonna make a highlight reel of deaths by Greg. Uh, yeah, I wasn't probably, planning to, uh, but at this point... <laughs> oh, let's not forget jump scares. For, I had one jump scare so far. He has had like... Five? Six, maybe? And I have none. So, so far. No, technically, I had two jump scares, but one from Greg and one from Rom next to me. <laughs> and Rom doesn't count in this context. Lawrence is tank. Okay. Let us save, yeah. So yeah, uh, how are you doing, Mettler? Hope you're doing well. <clears throat> uh, where the heck do we actually need to go here? Okay, over there. 
This is just to get the hell out of this place. Okay. Oh, they're blind. That's good. Just chilling. Okay. Yeah, I'll, I'll, I'll probably do a, a deaths uh, montage, but not jump scares because those would be a bit harder to find. Uh, oh, great. We're leaking air. We're going to need a space suit. Okay, for now, though... Yeah, let's just keep looking around at yeah, the, the trap mission. We got out of the first trap, and now we're on our way to try and get him into a second one. Okay, good on Ricardo for letting us out of the first trap, but... Yeah, numerically seeing, it would have been better to just keep <laughs> Amanda locked in, but that would have kind of defeated the whole purpose of the game. Yeah. If uh, we'd just been stuck in there and died. Okay, he's rummaging around in the vents. Okay. We need to head the other way, but I'm just looking here for anything of use. We've got a few codes that we don't ha haven't found a, a use for. Or at least two codes. Oh. What the heck happened to you? He got his brains blown out. <laughs> uh, are you jumpy or... No, you're not holding a pistol, so I presume you're not going to shoot me. He just seems to be mentally done. Okay. Oop. Uh... I heard something in the vents of one. Ah, this again. Stay on your toes. There we go. That's only the second time we've seen that little mini game. Okay. Well, at hey, least he's not computer. luring. The, at least he's not luring Greg over to us. Uh, Clark is Clark dead. Is de James, uh, Jameson Clark is dead. Last time I saw him, he was using some of the junk around the station to make explosives for protection. I told him to be careful, but when I got back from gathering supplies, it was just explosive damage and blood. I'm on my own now, so I'm going to come to you. Where are you, Elaine? Where are you, Elaine? Where are you, Elaine? And just errors from there on. Yeah, the more this place is falling apart, the more errors we're going to find, I think. Can't trust anyone. This place was made on the budget. And it shows. And it was being... This place was both made on the budget and torn apart on the budget. Yeah. Let's see, Midler. Admin, how would you be after hearing... Yep. I mean, how would you be after hearing death and people killing each other? Yeah. Greg, fuck off. Hmm. Okay. I got lucky there from just glancing back at the at the monitor. If if I'd kept reading there, I'd have walked right into him. Maybe it's a better idea to let Romy me read the chat the times, especially during these games. Yeah. Okay. I'll grab that. Is there a camera on the other side of this? Okay. Not sure where we picked up a key card, but probably best. Probably best to hurry as much as we can. Let's see. What will go? Uh, wait. What could go wrong with him reading chat when the monster is hunting him already? Uh, hunting him actively. Yeah. Oh, fucking great. Seek some executive ransom here. I'm sending over some samples for investigation. I want the minimum number of employees on this. 
Keep it on the down low and report only to me. If any of this gets out, I'll make sure your career dies with Sevastopol. There are a lot of inconsistencies in Gemini's ledgers. Do right by me, and I'll remember you. Whatever you're skimming now will seem like chicken feed. Do the smart thing. Wow, not even bothering with hiding the blackmail. Are we even supposed to be in here? Also, I don't even know another... anymore. No, it's not a blueprint. Uh, okay, we need to go that way further. Uh, I'm just hoping whatever happens to short out also unlock that door. Yeah, and also, again, or Ransom, Pakistan. its name is way, way too on the nose. Yeah. <laughs> like, Wade's name is a bit silly. Especially since but he doesn't Ransom? wait around. Yeah, it's, it's, it's just weird as a name to begin with. But Ransom, yeah, that's something it's... else. The lab can be separated from the main station. Bring it back online and systems can reconnect. Okay. Uh, Mettler, the typical manner of Wailing Utani upper management. That, this is Seekson. Not Wailing, yeah. so yeah. The rot is universal, well, they're in their apparently. Main but they still suck. They were for the Warning the tattered was no more. Rum, you might? What? It went very staticky for a bit there. For fuck's sake. It sounded like someone was sapping you a bit. Okay. But it sounds good now. Yeah, something must have been uh, causing interference for a sec or something. I, I think something on your computer may have... Uh, I think there might be a second... Uh, uh, oh, hell, the fuck happened? There might be a second uh, microphone on your computer that interferes or something. Probably either the webcam or my headset. Okay. You should be... Oops. If you should be able to disable, uh, you should be able to disable them in the sound settings. Hang on. And the easiest way to get there, to my knowledge, is to just right-click the little speaker in the lower right, wherever you ah. have your taskbar. Sounds and yeah, then it should also Sound show the menu with the playbacks and such. Yeah. Oh, I remember something. Something curious I heard of late. Um. Okay, two two things that are odd. Nvidia plans to start their own computer One, line. Two, three. Can you hear me? Yep. I can hear you. Okay. But yeah, Nvidia wants to start to make their own computers, and Apple is launching their own console. Okay. We live in the weird ass timeline. Yeah, like. <laughs> Valve launches Steam Deck makes sense. They've been wanting to make a console for a long time, and they've been doing game for a long time. They make sense. I wouldn't. I almost wouldn't even call the deck uh, as console because it's just basically a handheld computer. Yeah. And mm. Asus and other companies have been trying to make a saw that and trying to go into that and make their own versions of it. And those versions has been rather. Eh. Yeah, or just outright disastrous. Like, oh, hey, one version of them actually exploded from a Windows update. <laughs> okay. Fucking hell. Yeah, I, I think they exaggerated when they would explode and do. Yeah, they, they, they broke from it. One, two, three, four. Okay, I disabled the. Uh... I disabled my. Webcam microphone, okay. so hopefully that helped. I think Ripley can oh, just drink some of the uh, ethanol. Uh, uh, I'm pretty sure she more than wants to. A mystery noise maker to Norse maker. <laughs> It'll be really funny to use, like. <laughs> um. Okay, so I'm guessing that's a foil. Stealthy. 
because nobody notices him notices him among the piping. Okay, I, I'm get I'm guessing when we're crafting something, other sounds are muted because we're well focused on crafting something. Which points for immersion, uh, but I take away three points because fuck you. I think I just saw a bit of his legs here. Wow. Not the move I wanted. Let's just pull this fucking lever and get the fuck out. That's it. I can see a power spike. Now, reconnect the lab systems to Sebastopol from the console in the central lab. We're counting on you, Ripley. Hazardous material leak detected. I'm guessing it's in yeah that's in there uh, oh, only one entrance of course good security design not good design for us at the moment yeah yeah I suspect it was designed to be easily evacuated but I don't think they took account about on the dual um Seen the morphs? Yeah. This place is detachable, so in case anything goes wrong in place in a place like this, which well is would be very likely, uh, if they can just cut it off. Uh, there, 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 and there. Is he just working on his legs or something? Or just dropping down and jumping back in immediately? I see that other little... It's the other lab parts. Oh dear. I lose track of him. Oh, we might want to get to the exit. Yeah. Probably a good idea. And we're going to grab something and run. You, you know the drill. Yeah, I'll try. For people who the context, make sure the captain doesn't die. Okay, that was a good gamble there. Because they're there. I'm sorry, Ripley. Oh, great. Bit of a dick move there, wait. No, I get you, it. You don't wait. <laughs> yeah. I get it. You wanted to make sure the xenomorph stayed the fuck out, but still dick move. It does not look go in the way we want. He's in there. Okay. 
Okay, he's in that other room, I think, slash hope. Good fuck. the fucker. Okay, he's somewhere that way. Piss off! Now we're just gonna hope he doesn't get into these vents. I think he's in front of you. I had a big feeling that if I popped out right there, it would have just been right in front of his freaking face. Just to make absolutely sure... Yeah, that was... that was well-timed. If I'd been a bit late with that, I was just chucked it inside here. This might be a mistake. Get to the airlock. Put on the suit. And yeah, that's kind of the thing about uh, airlocks. They kind of open. And I hear a little chaos. Oh yeah, uh, Wait decided to launch the module with Ripley still inside. Oh yeah, it, I, I, that's why I said I had, a, I had my headphones still on. Yeah. But bloody heck, Wait. I mean, I get it, but still a dick move, man. Yeah, yeah I, guess, I guess we should change his name from Waits to Dicks. Because he can eat a whole bag of them. One second. So, about three and a half heart okay, attacks later. Food, I'll be right back. Okay. All right. Oof. <sighs> Let's <sighs> get out of this half assed power suit. I doubt for this even worked. Hello? Can anyone hear me? Ripley, is that you? Yes, wait. Me, you son of a bitch. You locked me in. You blew the lab into space. I had no choice. No choice at all. You saw that thing. You saw what it could do. I had to get it off the station. By any means necessary. Yeah. Use me as bait. <laughs> I mean to die. And it goddamn worked, Ripley. It goddamn worked. I got that thing. Jettisoned it into the gas giant. The station's safe. There's that. And there's the fact that you're a heartless bastard. I'm heading back to the Bureau. We can discuss your methods there. Ripley, out. I just had a bit of a thought, seeing as we don't have any actual medical supplies, are we basically just injecting glue into our veins in the hopes of it both gluing something vital shot? 
microwave? <laughs> no, both of them are gone for foods. Is there something I need to find here or oh, no, just need to cut it open. Okay. There we go. But yeah, at least we're rid of fucking Greg. Okay. But how this usually goes with these games is you deal with the alien and then you deal with the fucking corporation trying to kill you afterwards. Oh, you think you're dead with that MC in the morph? Want to realize it doesn't need, it doesn't breathe air. Yeah. Hmm. Have we been here before? Yes, we have been. Okay. Yeah. We... Okay, you weren't here last time. Uh, well, I was getting a shotgun is probably not a good sign. Uh, wait, there's something else. Key cards. Key card. Okay. Good against humans. Don't use against xenomorphs. Yeah, since. Well, you're getting a buckshot of acid blood in your face in return. That all depend on the type. You tickle it or just make it angry. Again, there are some variants that are bulletproof. Yeah. And one that's surprisingly rocket proof as well. Okay, heading in the right direction. Okay. Guess we're going to have to kick Waits' ass. Okay. Okay, but it does. <laughs> Amanda's probably happy that she can just walk around normally instead of destroying her knees every single second that she's crouching around. No thanks to Waits. He's a ruthless son of a bitch. Always has been. Stubborn too. If he'd ever listened to me, things would never have gone this far. It's done now. I'm sorry for fucking up with the lockdown earlier. Forget it. You got me out in the end. I'll see you back at the bureau. Yep. I'll take that. Completely missed them before, I think, if we've even come from this area before. Okay, some sort of luggage passage. Okay. Oh, that's actually... That's actually not run, apparently. That's a bunch of looters. Okay. So uh, someone we need to they... get yeah, one of them saw look he has some sort of helmet, so probably security. Hmm. Yeah, saw them take aim at you. Yeah. Okay. Wouldn't be too surprised if a lot of people just basically left the security because of weights. Now how do we restore power here? Let's see. That's sealed, and we can't cut that open. Um, that's not powered. Can we get that cleaning thing to move? Maybe we can use that to open the hatch. Okay, as long as we don't get shot. Okay. Like how? Ramming it? Nope. Uh, okay. No, we. Oop. There we go. Uh, okay, apparently half of those were har uh, armed and the other ones. <laughs> oh, they're just making a run for their life because. 
Honestly, at this point, Amanda is strapped with a revolver, a shotgun, and a flamethrower. Let's be honest. If you saw someone walking around in an area like this, just <laughs> loaded like that, you would turn around. You would, you would be like that one, uh, uh, one henchman in Batman the animated series who sees Batman in a room and just nopes the fuck out. Yeah, and also that's one huge Roomba. It's basically an industrial Roomba. Okay. EMP V2. Okay. Don't know exactly what upgrading them does. Uh, let's see. Hmm. I guess it could be... Uh, I guess it could be using less resources or something. It was the EMP mine, right? Yeah, may as well make one of them. It does clear us out completely of charge packs. I I, I honestly thought that we'd get... Hey, you, know, you got the shotgun. Of, yep. Uh, I th honestly thought we'd get the... Yeah, the amount that we can hold expanded as one point or another, but apparently not. Or maybe I nope. just completely missed it. I don't really know. Okay. About to rain on the parade. Something's up with the androids. Something's been up with the damn androids since I got here. No, this is new. They've left their posts. I just saw some of them in a public area. That's not normal. Great. Watch your back. I was just about to say. Well, yeah, we've dealt with one problem now to deal with uh, who knows how many more on this damn station. Yeah. How the EMP griffins works on those? But yeah, said, it, it works, works on, on those. A good thing. I think it said works on non industrial synthetics. Yeah. Given so the fact that. Oh, well. Honestly, I think it might work in the working Joe's, if nothing else, because you might need it. Yeah. It, yeah, it would be rather bullshit to get an, a quote unquote weapon or gadget that just doesn't work. Yeah. At the very least, it might stun them. Yeah, I hope so. For, they said non industrial synthetic. This then makes you wonder wait, are these, these industrial? A little bit more heavy duty and wouldn't need to bother with. Uh, Hiding their appearance and such, or with All the right. humanoidish appearance. Yeah, those are weight. Those are Whalen Yutani style. Sneakzons are more inexplicably looks like a wax man. Uh, we're more say rubber or plastic. They, they are they are permanent residents of the Uncanny Valley. Yep. I, don't, I don't want to use Uncanny Valley either, but they, they look like they're Puppets. made from sheep Halloween masks, if you get what I mean. Yeah, like Mike Myers. What's going on with the androids? Yeah. I don't know. What about the change in our world status? Damn it, I don't know. I'm trying to contact Samuels. Maybe he knows what the hell Apollo is playing at. Okay. They had said earlier that Samuels is an android as well, though honestly I yeah, don't... I'm not sure he, what would he... be the big tell. His well, inabil his dull surprise and white blood. I'm not sure we've seen him bleed, but yeah, that yeah, could just yeah, be my inexperience with the series. They mentioned he was a synthetic, but they do call me variants. And I don't think he's yeah. linked up uh, with Apollo. Oh. Oh, great. A working Joey apparently has a black belt, and fuck you. Apparently.
course he's standing right fucking there. Okay, now, now we're dealing with a synthetic zombie apocalypse, basically. Okay, not going that way. Yeah, the problem's you, Joe. Well, someone's providing a distraction. Not much point with stealth if we can outrun them, but I'd rather not risk the conflict to begin with. And of course, it's a dead end here. actually expect that to open. Wait, for God's sakes, Apollo's let the androids off the leash. They're attacking on site. I don't know what the hell this is. They're not just responding to trespass violations. It's like they're hunting. For who? For everyone and anyone. What do you mean? Stand by. What do you mean, stand by? I mean, shut up. I'm trying to figure this out. Try not to die. Those jokes can be surprisingly quick at times. I'll make better use of that than you. Okay, I can't even tell what that's supposed to say. Read the order line on the bottom. You can yeah, save the hand to us. Oh, the irony. Well, it yeah, is safe, safe hands with me. And I say that when I have a hand on his shoulder and an axe to his face. <laughs> yeah. It sees us. You know what? Fuck it. You have a shotgun. Use it. it not, not even bothering. It, of course it goes right over his fucking shoulder. Okay, at least it's one hit kill if it does hit. You still need to loot to fit. Fun fact about the shotgun model. It actually mm -hmm. is one of those designs that seems to have two magazine tubes on it. it at least the design is based off an old prototype shotgun that didn't make mass production, but there are shotguns with dual magazine tubes. Okay. But Amanda seems to be only using one since it only has a four-round magazine capacity. Which makes sense. She probably absolutely only knows take the safety off and pull the trigger and bump. And that's mostly just yeah. instinct. She probably doesn't know the whole how to switch tubes when she runs out of one. She's a mechanic after all, not a freaking soldier. Yeah. Hard to tell which of these will and won't open. Well, I already. Oh, oh, another one. Okay. Those are close together. Hmm. Of course, this one doesn't open. I'll give you a map. So that's worth. Some... I guess maybe we could always use Super Rome as a battery ram. <laughs> Why? You have a helmet. Oh wait, I'm also having a helmet. Oh, but... Wearing a hammer, I mean. These motherfuckers are oddly stealthy as well. What the heck was he saying there? Do androids dream? All right, it ended up sounding louder like a bed phone speaking to. Um, demonic. Going chance. demonic? <laughs> oh, I mean, he that's was impossible. Dying. Man, oh. <laughs> remember that death I pin I showed you when I was playing Crisis? I think so. I, I think I've ha I think I've actually uh, uploaded photos, no, not screenshots of uh, enemy characters ending up like that in some games. 
Mm, yeah, right, use... At least they looted security somewhere, it seems. Um, Can we way? use him as a battery ram? <laughs> Maybe. It would be more like a slug. But... Okay. Anything of use around here? Whatever the hell this is. It looks oh, like these are sleeping hotel. cubicles. I yeah, think. those. That looks like a capsule hotel. Hmm. I'm guessing this is where people who couldn't make it to their rooms just sort of stayed the night. Could be. Hmm. Never been at any of those. Hope I probably never have to be either. If you ever go to Japan, those are usually the cheapest available option. Yeah. Hmm, that's locked from the other side. Nope. I'm guessing you will unlock that? Let's see. Heist, you still there? Why the hell didn't we have the smarts to stay on the, uh, the NSD, NSCdora? NSCdora. Yeah. Uh, they shut me in a lab over um, in the Systex Spire. For the love of God, come find me. Elevators are out and there are bodies everywhere. I'm sure I'm, I can hear it in the walls. Oh, okay, I get it. This is for visiting guests. No profile. I'm leaving this for you when you wake up. I know that you're still all over the place after that thing came I'll be right back. But you've got to okay. stop fucking up like this. You got way too drunk. I told those people sleeping in the mall way too much. I dragged you away when I saw the look in your eyes. We can't go back to the gas. No one can know we're connected to my own India store. Okay, that explains where the rest of the crew went. They basically went, fuck this shit, I'm out. Oh dear. And yeah, nothing to activate. Hmm. Okay. How do we get these open? Hmm. Didn't we see that sign before? I think we did. Yeah, might be the back door for it. Hmm. Okay. How are we to tell which open and which won't? So this one looks. Okay, that's an insult. Bunkhouse Hotel. Okay, we obviously can't go through here. Is there somewhere we can get behind something? Hmm. Is there really... Is there maybe a vent or something here? Crawl space. So how do I keep equipping those by accident? Okay, we can't climb into these. I just wanted to test that if they would allow that. Oh, I have a lag. Hmm. Again, we are having a storm somewhere in Sweden. Okay. So it could uh, interfere with uh, something somewhere. Hmm. Okay, let's... It's cold outside here, but again, those pools could be far, far, far away for all I know. Okay, that's odd. We're supposed to be able to use the outer lining of this to see where we need to go, but it just goes in a circle here, so I guess we need to be downstairs. Is there anything I can think of? Okay, let's put a bit of speed wait, behind wait, this. Wait, I saw something, I saw something. Treasure! <laughs> no. But X marks the spot! Not this time. Yeah, that's not opening. I 
I'm pretty sure I walked up to that one and it didn't open before. Okay. But this is, what the heck does that sign up there would it all say? Colonial Marshals. All right. Uh, Federal uh, Mr. Uh, security for us. I heard 40 foot said Corporal Marshals. I've got some security shutters in my way. Can you open them? Wait. You bastards, you murdering bastards. Leave them alone. Stand down. We shouldn't be here. You're becoming a stone. You bastards. <laughs> uh, I guess we don't want to head to the Marshals anymore. Fucking peachy. I'm back. How badly did things go? Yeah, uh, Wade's got uh, a neck massage by the by the androids. From the sounds of it. Ouch. Yeah, I should probably say this: the androids come in different variants, especially these and tactics. Some of the tactics are actually fighting for independence. Huh. This one's here, our Dolphin can, for they mm. probably don't have the hardware for it. Yeah, not the intelligence for it. Wayland Yutani ones, they'd probably be smart enough to. Oh, now this is open. As in being more self aware. Yeah. <laughs> open says Amanda. Now, so we can recharge this thing. Uh, how about you? Uh, are you stuck? No, it's waiting for you to move. There we go. There. For a second, I thought it was stuck in place. But oh, so we have, we've honestly only seen one big glitch so far. Yeah. And I would say they are durable. Yep. Yeah. Like, you shot him in the face with a shotgun. And it didn't pop off like a melon. Yeah, I, I, I know they're not human, they probably have a few things on that, but... They, they're not exactly built as your traditional robots to begin with. Yeah, but they are stronger than your average person. At the very least, there's part, part for the fact that they need to move heavy stuff and such. But so yeah. Listen. So listen, I was not expecting you to see average bear. <laughs> okay. Uh, three of those. There, there, and there. Okay. The imp mine. There. It's probably a shortcut. Nope. Or maybe yes. It leads somewhere. Where do we get the feeling I'm going to find some goodies around here? It'd be fun. It's also strange to not fear the xenomorphs in the vents anymore. Yeah, we haven't seen... we didn't see that. But if you are in the vents while the xenomorph is in there as well, then yeah, obviously they'll grab you. Mm-hmm. Okay, where did this put us? Another locked off area. Not as locked off. There's a kitchen! Hmm. Or a... Dining? Diner or something? A small dining diner. room. Yeah, let's see, what are your plans? Hey, Mart, I guess you've heard about the station decommissioned by now. What are your plans? I've got some connections that can hook me up with work when we leave. I can't promise anything, but maybe they can find you something too. They've started closing down the stores in Galeria. In the Galeria. Uh, your place was still boarded up from last year. Sorry you had to lose it. You never seem to catch a break. Do you still hear from Margaret and the kids? Maybe you should go see them when you leave Sevastopol. Let me know if you want to ask... Uh, if, yeah, if you want me to ask around for you. Jillen. 
security risk. Blythe, we need to find a way to shut down those automated janitors. They're a security problem. Every time they start their cleaning circuit, there's a risk they'll open up a route for that thing that's hunting us. Or at the very least, let looters in. Uh, test of Sevastopol. The commission process is now on the way. Please read carefully and take note. Initial team is on station to survey Sevastopol and initiate the decommissioning process. Please help them in any way you can. We have enough food and medical supplies. The redirection of the supply ship flight plan uh, flight path will not impact on your quality of life. Rationing will, however, be need, uh, deemed necessary if stocks run low. Hoarding and illegal trading will not be tolerated. Please report suspicious activity to Sikhs and security who will investigate in cooperation with the colonial marshals. A, pro yeah. A population rehoming service has been established. We are happy to help you with your next step, but we are not liable for costs incurred. If you require financial support, we recommend Sikhs and credit services. The decommission is final. You must relocate or you will be faced with forced removal. Okay, so basically they went, fuck you, no more fresh fruit for everyone. Also, fuck you, you're, you have to pay for your own way off. And if you can't, we're well, going to probably give you a rent of 500%, not a rent, uh, an interest rate of 500% or something. For an exit. Uh, I'm scared. Uh, him. That one I didn't even see. Just like the other times. And I'm pretty sure the one that was lying at the power plant earlier, that one was probably fake. No, that's probably not intentionally fake, but just knocked down and didn't give a fuck to get back up for some reason or another. Possibly, Hello. but he will jump scare me in the other on the other Go. streams. It's the marshals. Okay. Wait, we should talk about what happened in San Cristobal. Now, it was a nasty business, and I understand that you want to deal with it as quietly and quickly as possible. But I wanted to make sure you didn't do anything rash. I'm talking about catching the specimen without killing it. If we played smart, we could be set up for life. I have the connection. I can set it up. You're getting all this, you can't do this forever. And what are you gonna do when Sevastopol closes? You have my number. Ransom out. <sighs> let's see, nothing new here. And yeah, it sounds like Ransom was pulling from the same stock as Wayland Yutani, with its uh, executives just being fucking idiots. Like, how many times have they tried to weaponize the Xenomorphs already? Like, a dozen times, and it hasn't worked out a single one? Yeah. It sounds like something is slapping together somewhere. This is not the way to go, so this is going to lead to... Goodies. We are finding quite a bit of stuff now. There. Might as well try and make use of some of it. Not enough for that. Not enough for that. Maxed out. Maxed out. And I just remember something. There's a thing like yeah. it's from the comics. Hmm. Uh, the aliens, the Seamoths were used as a... Well, basically as a bait for any advanced species that is warlike. Like, if you see them and you want to weaponize them, then you just walked into the trap. Yeah. That sounds about right. For your entire species. This is where we got the flamethrower. And that one from the from the original engineers, where they were still called Yorkies, and they even had another name, I forgot what it was. That one makes a bit sense, even though a bit... Yeah, extreme. At least, at least better than what we got from Prometheus. 
Yeah. Also, uh, yeah, Marlow got out, and if he's if you find a quote unquote empty cell, or even if you find an empty cell, don't be dumb and stand in the doorway and looking around because you're very likely to just get shoved in. Okay. Okay, looks like they already fucked off. Okay, but what is going on with the Joes? Not this way. So what is that noise? It's as if someone's getting... Okay, you're lucky to be alive. Everyone else is dead. They're all dead. The Android slaughtered them. Why? Why the fuck? I don't know. But I think Samuels does. Samuels? Why? Wait, send him to access Apollo. I need to find him. Have you seen Taylor and Marlo? No. No. They're not here. I think they might have got clear. Ricardo. Ricardo, if I go after Samuels, can you run this place? I need eyes and ears. I'm not fucking staying here. Ricardo, I need you to do this. Can you man the station and keep me covered? Ricardo! Yeah, sure. Of course. Sit tight. No Lock the fucking doors and don't let anyone in. Look after me. I'll come back for you. And and we we had sent people here for safety. I'm guessing that sound is just something glitching out into something else, or whatever. Or maybe it's supposed to be something in the vents getting knocked around or something. Speaking of knocked around... Don't forget to check. It, it just sounds like some something is getting slapped around or... But whatever, it's... I don't even know how to describe it. Like a half-wet rag getting... Yeah, hit against a wall over and over. That's still locked. Okay. I hear two. Hmm. Okay, for now we just gotta dodge the Joes. Shotgun shell. I, I think it might be a corpse glitching out into the floor somewhere or something. Okay. Let me in. Let me in. <laughs> Someone was going to make the joke. May as well be me. There's a blueprint for something in there. Can't really tell what it is because most of it is too dark to see. There's another Joe. Okay, at least the Joes can't instant kill us. Though I probably should make use of one of these. Okay, which of these do we need? This one. We're back, thefts. Thieves and pickpockets operate in this area. Protect your belongings. Report any crimes or suspicious activity to the Colonial Marshal Bureau. Nobody here. Yeah, we are here. <clears throat> I 
beware of backstab. I come back from. You pay. Stop that stupid thing in already. Perfect timing. Okay, and out of this hellhole into, well, another hellhole. At From least it's a Xenomorph free hellhole. Yay. Yeah, not the only thread on board. I, I, uh, I, think you, I think you both miss having uh, realized the Xenomorph is still around. Or a Xenomorph is still around. No, don't speak, don't speak. I'm talking about me. Oh uh, yeah, that's true. <laughs> well, you're in trying to eat us, so you don't count as a threat. I'm not sure I can do this. Ricardo, I need you to focus. You're in charge now. In charge? In charge of what? A room full of dead people? This is fucked up! Focus, Ricardo. If Samuels can talk to Apollo, he can get the androids to stand down. Then this will all be over. There we go. Perfectly timed. Okay. Yeah, I, I can't blame Ricardo, but he also just stared down the Xenomorph earlier in the freaking tower at the first trap. Then again, he... He probably bailed hard before he actually caught sight of it. Yeah. We need supplies. Take what you can from whoever you want. I found an area of habitation where we can seal ourselves in and wait for rescue. I've got guys welding vents shut and shutting off elevators. Plan is to make it watertight. So. There's no room for more people in the sanctuary, but we can make space for their food, meds, water, and guns. If we're gonna get everyone through this alive, there's no room for pity. Okay. Uh, yeah, it, it isn't really too noticeable behind Vakir, but yes, ink is dancing around my legs. Mm. So time for the interference. Oh dear. What do you want? You've been you were napping on my bed for like two hours straight. And before that, she was lying on uh, on my parents' bed. Uh, next to my mother, along with Charlie. Have, have I talked about Charlie before on stream? Maybe? I remember Oscar Inky. Who's Charlie again? Uh, Charlie is a, a neighborhood cat who has been visiting practically daily now. And he's gotten comfortable enough to... Yes, Ink, I know you exist. He's been, yeah, gotten comfortable enough to... Well, not only head inside, but go up and sleep on my parents' bed. <laughs> Oh, right, that Charlie, all right. So, yeah, he was just... <laughs> he was just napping against her, uh, along with Ink here. Because she hasn't been feeling too well. Not really sick, but just, yeah, taking things easy. Uh, did not mean to do that. Uh, let's see, speaker... Okay, don't see anything really need to mess with here. If I saw any working Joes, I'd definitely mess with them, but... And if... Are you getting up on the desk now, Ink? She's been... Yep, she is. She has been really insistent on me paying attention to her, to the point that she's been headbutting my mouse hands. <laughs> You're just going well, to stand uh, in front of me? I feel like uh, she likes it. Does she do that to other people or only you? Hmm, not that I know of, really. And now she's just waving her tail in my face. Yeah, you, you may want to ask that for it. It might be something she actually likes you more than the rest. Or that's how she shows affection to all of you. I think she spends most of the yeah uh, most of the time when she is uh, they're laying together with someone else. It's with my yeah uh, with my mother on the bed, but I'm definitely a second on that because when she gets chased off the bed there because they want to get up, 
she typically goes towards me. And this now she's now she's just running back and forth across me or in front of me. So how do I get up? How did one we'll get up? How did that even happen? I think one of the Joes is behind us. And now she's just headbutting my, my other arm. Okay, like, so tell us how it would have looked like if someone, another android had been successful in the first movie. Uh, like, oh. I, I, I know... <laughs> I know magazines try to make their articles easily digestible, but I don't think in this way. This is horrifying. Okay, now she's just sitting next to my arm, expecting pats. Sometimes she's... Yeah, passcode, okay. Sometimes she just stares at the, my second monitor. And now, now she's just bumping her head against it. Don't you have a mouse to find in the house? Because there's one loose in the... Well, there's one loose somewhere downstairs. The, the, the reason we... Dis, how we discovered the mouse was it jump scared my father. Because apparently it was hiding in his shoes when he was trying to put them on. And, well, you can guess how that went. And we're back up here. Well, at least he did it. Uh, they must not stay inside when he put his feet inside the shoe. Yeah, it would have been dead otherwise from the stench alone. <laughs> got, a, got at least a snort out of you with that one. Yeah, I never heard Ron snort. <laughs> yeah. But yeah, it's something for the cast to catch. Like we have a we had a suspicion that there was a mouse behind the cupboards at least. Okay, what made you jump there, Ink? You just you just jolted. Okay. I think she might have heard something downstairs that I can't hear. Okay. I hope we can find the pass you know, the, the passcode that we need somewhere around here. Hmm. Yep. Okay, why are you holding my finger with your claw there, Ink? Maybe Ink is scared. Would I try to comfort him for he's scared? No. She can't hear the game, but she does seem to be reacting a bit. And now she's gone to the other side again. I'm pretty sure she can hear the game with a better hearing than you. If she stands close enough. Probably. <coughs> now she's back on the other side again. Is this where we need to... Hmm. We need to go the other way. But we can't... Hmm. Do we need to go hunting around for the passcode in other areas or something? That's gonna be Maybe. annoying. Yes, yes, Ink. Hmm. Okay, now it's pointing that way again. Hmm. Yep. Now she's practically sitting on my arm. What? Hmm. Bear arm oh. now. Okay, just a rewire. Okay. That time she has taken on just plain sitting on my arm to try and get attention. Hmm. Something caught her attention behind the monitor. Hmm. Where are we so Oh. I probably should have looked over here, shouldn't I? We were distracted by a certain... Uh, um... 
furball. Uh, what's to say, corpse? Uh, let's see. Don't be mad, but I went through the uh, through to the elevator shafts and shut the access door behind me. I had a jaw on my tail, so I had to get out of there. If you can find something to cut through the panel, the code is 8382. Don't worry, if not, Ned, I'm coming back uh, down for you now. No sign of the lovebirds, but I've got a whole heap of guns and supplies up here. Russell. And I think we've seen that before. And, well, uh, guess those guns didn't do them much good. There. Okay, just checking if there was anything else in here, but no, only the vent access. Oh, pardon? <clears> hmm. <throat> okay, that, that cottage pie was really freaking good, but it's also rather heavy on the stomach. Oh, look. What a staircase. What a what a bridge. Okay, I was half expecting it to fail underneath us. I, I guess they did not cheap out on ladders. The one thing they didn't cheap out on. Yeah. <laughs> the public for due to they knew that it... Yeah, you you won't you don't want to cheap out on ladders for that will just cost Way too much. Yep. Well, I guess the... Amanda, you might want... Want to use both your arms on this? What was it? What was that elevator carrying? Kerosene and C4? It landed something that was explosive. Probably want to wait to straps for the Xenomorph. Probably. Right, they don't really need the elevator, though it would be pretty freaking hilarious to just uh, summon an elevator, uh, it opens, and there's just a xenomorph watching its <laughs> watching its imaginary watch, <laughs> tapping their foot uh, impatiently. Uh, I should go... I should go see what uh, Robot Chicken has made on the Aliens franchise again. Okay, they are so getting up there. Throw the EMP. Yeah, I think I, re I regretted watching uh, one of their Jurassic Park references. Shoot it again. Okay, I did call it. And yeah, double tap as zombie I mean, lands teaches. Like the place synthetics go to die. You might want to continue reloading your revolver. Right. There we go. Uh, let's see. Okay. Yes, yes, Ink. You will get pets. <laughs> I think I heard her boop something. Yeah, that'd be my arm. You know, I just remembered they made her a, throwing something down. They made a synthetic clone of Ripley, didn't they? They isn't that a isn't that what three is all about or something? No, three is Ripley being impregnated with an alien queen. Uh, yeah, that fucker's gonna move. Uh, Resurrection has them clone her, and since they use her blood. It had also parts of Xenomorph, so she was part Xenomorph as well. Yeah, but I yeah. don't know, I don't know the, like... I can't understand why people dislike the third movie, but why... I feel like they would have more problems with the fourth, considering... How the heck do you get DNA when someone throw themselves into molten metal? Yeah. Hot molten metal, by the way. If I remember yeah, correctly... It would kind of need to be hot to melt. Reason... There was a Ripley android was because the comic she's she uh she first initially showed up she was supposed to be Ripley the real Ripley alongside Hicks and Newt but this was before Alien Three got released and they got killed off 
So, upon re releases, the Hicks XP and the Nude Hicks XP got, uh, re got new names, and Ripley became uh, an android. Gotcha. <clears throat> Fitting. Uh, reformat chamber. I think I've spent uh, I've sent up some blank androids for the VIP Sevastopol Sail Tour. If you haven't done it before, just have them lie on the slab in the reformat chamber. It'll connect to Apollo and upgrade them with the latest programming. Let's hope they bite, Russell. Well, hopefully not the freaking androids. This is Seeks and Executive Ransom speaking. I just woke up to find a working Joe in my suite, and when I asked what the hell it was doing, it lunched for me. I had to leave my own fucking apartment. Send your best technicians to Apollo Core and find out what the hell is going on now. Get those things under control. I want a full report ASAP. No. The door appears below. I can't get near it. Oh, blown in that way. Yep. Power level too high. Okay, that's what we're basically turning the generators off. Power. What is it with them all the, f all over the fucking place here? And why are some of them ripped in? Yeah, apart. Like the one by the, your feet. Yeah. Biocontainment has a level omega. We're experiencing a height for. How do you know it's alive? I don't think you can really hide from a thing that just saw you hide. Yep. Called it. It's important. Shoot it! Yeah, my turn now. I'm... There we go. Good. And now you're covered in that. Yeah. To be fair, at this point, Amanda's probably covered in enough stuff that she's a biological hazard. Yeah. So a little, so a little synthetic blood doesn't do much of anything, really. Also, just a bit earlier, Ink, ink was licking the back of my hand. Oh, that means they plan to eat you. <laughs> and it, it, I think it means something... It's a sign of affection, I do believe, yeah? Yeah. If the cat channels ought to be believed. I'll be right back. I need a bathroom. Okay. All right. Do we need a bathroom? All right, I guess I'm going to bring it over. Wolver ammo, bit of scrap. Also... We have so many of these bloody things, I may as well use some of them. And there's a replacement immediately. Mm. So I'm pretty sure you'd want to point this thing away from your face. Ink, ink is quite literally starting to butt in on my arm now. Forgotten about you, motherfucker. Uh, wait, do you see the pose? Yeah. Looks very polite. Mm -hmm. okay, stop pushing against my arm. Oh, nuisance. Uh, great. I actually forgot you could throw those. Right, then I'll have to find a way to talk to Apollo directly. Biocontainment has a level Omega. All permissions rescinded. I don't have time for this. <laughs> okay, just fold them like laundry. <laughs> I'll be right back. 
All right. You gotta dispose of some stuff. Okay. Good luck. Good luck. Uh, also, Samuel didn't notice me shining the light in his face. Yeah, but uh, what do you think? No, he definitely is as synthetic as himself, ain't he? Yeah. Just double confirmed. <laughs> like I said, he, he just folded like that Joe like he were freaking laundry. Charge pack. At least he hasn't gone rogue. That we know of. Because we know that androids can lie, I believe, from the first movie and such. A shotgun shell. Let's see. Suzanne, sweetheart, I'm going to have to rain check. I'm getting reports from downstairs about abnormal android behavior. It might have something to do with all those folk nooks going missing. I need you to get to the showroom and shut yourself in. There's a lockdown button near my desk from when, uh, from when these machines were actually worth something. Don't worry about them, they're only display models. Just sit tight, I'll sort this out and we can celebrate the deal finally going through when we're not on company time. Okay. Last chance. Spedding. I'm expecting the VIPs to get here early, so I want you and your people ready and waiting to greet them. The clock's ticking down, and this is our last chance to salvage something from this piece of shit. I want your people to answer their every whim and every vice and laugh at every one of their fucking jokes. Take them to the showroom when they're ready, don't rush them, and don't bore them with speeches. If they say they want something changed in the working jokes, just say yes, we can let the tech heads worry about it later. I hope you uh, have your best people on this. Okay, what is getting your attention now, Ink? She's just staring at the door now. And showroom appointments. Date night. <laughs> Nothing else. <laughs> okay. Oh, uh, great. Display bottles. Yeah, I don't trust it. Hmm. Now she did take... Hmm, wait. If she took his advice and locked himself in here, that locked herself in here, then how did you... They got their head smashed into the desk. Give me the battery. Yeah, that's a warning sign. What is some okay, yeah, those things are gonna get up and try to kill you. Yeah. Feels like the moment you should probably put uh put explosives on the on the floor. Yeah, I mean you got EMP I don't know mines, if I can you might recover well... them. You got EMP mines, might as well actually use them. Yeah. He also one of the move. Hmm. Why am I being paranoid here now? Here we go. Okay, we can yeah, recover them if need be. Okay. Also, since we might not have any other opportunity to see these in use. Might as well. It's the fucking... <laughs> the fucking, uh... What is the word for them again? Pipe uh, bomb. No, not pipe bomb, but uh, in improvised explosive IED. IED. Okay, where is this button then? Under the console. Wait, wait. What's the acronym again? Improvised I explosive device or pipe bomb. I D E. I E. I -E. I -E. Okay, okay. Yeah, of course, the fucker has a bar set up here. Yeah, this He's is rich. Ransom's place. He's rich. What do you expect? And he was dating his secretary. Of course. Is that even a surprise? Is it really a scummy 
Mem is it really a scummy corporate man if they aren't fucking their secretary? Point. Okay, where is the unlock down buttons around here? So can't I just... Hmm. Oh, either they are for show, or we have to wait for them for us to open the door to trigger them. Okay, that, that actually looked like they were pouring out coconut milk from the skull. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, well, some people do call... <laughs> do you know, say that... Well, yeah, sometimes people's heads get called their coconuts. What? Not sure where the hell else I was going with that. Showroom appointments... None. Also, you might want to reload again. Yeah. Mm -hmm. It's locked on button near my desk. Near. Near. So you just oh, have to there. find... That is so stupidly easy to notice we all fucking missed it. Yeah. You might want to pick up the imp mine and put it on the middle point. Yeah, at least one of those fuckers is going to get up. Oh, what a car track. We aren't even doing anything. This just came out of left fucking field. That, that, there that's you are. Okay. Oh, you can help by setting that off. Thank <laughs> you. <laughs> <laughs> okay, Ooh, I, we we miss them getting ragged all there. <laughs> yeah. Okay, so they all get up like yeah. individual. Yeah, you should all. Yeah, no, nope, EMP mine would have been a smart place to just put it in the middle. Hey, start shotguns. Bloop. And a blueprint for something. It, did they give up? They really gave up that easily. It didn't. They didn't give up. The door locked behind them. They're trying to tear it open. Ew. Uh, well then, just in case. Just put a pipe bomb in an EMP mine. Just, just, just in case. I think the pipe bomb should be enough, hopefully. <laughs> 13 rounds. Yeah, four in the... Oh, I, we found a gun stash. Yay. Flashlight batteries. Drink. Yep, the spirit EMP mine. And finally, a save station again. Let me first loot the place. Okay. Doesn't surprise me that Ransom had st this stuff uh, stashed there, uh, hoarded up. Again, gummy company man. Okay. No save. Hmm. Ah, for a second there, the chat said that it had to reconnect. We're still alive, and well, if. If we'd gotten a disconnect, actually, you we might want to heal up. I think mean, probably. Yeah. I mean, it's still alive. Yeah, yeah. If, if there'd been you problems said with alive. that, you two. Yeah. <laughs> oh, also that, yes. If, oh, Why do we get the feeling they're going to actually bust through that? They haven't been able to break. You know, there's five of them, or seven. I didn't. Oh, that's gonna end poorly. EMP mine! Would have been a good place to place one of those. Just chuck it. At this point, just chuck it. Oh dear. Nope. Okay, did not expect it to go off on contact. Okay, what? Reload, 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 reload! No, you're out! Reload! I, I, I was holding. That actually stuns him quite a long time. 
Okay. There's ODM, please work again. Joe's, what do you know? Maybe one of these things had a key card. Okay, oh, so with the shotgun to reload, you first press it to start, and then you hold it to keep yeah, reloading. Okay. I'm pretty sure that's the same with the other gun in the game. Yeah, with you know, the, the revolver, revolver, it's just to hold it. Yeah. Oh dear. Hey, did you check the... Hey, did you actually check the logs of the guy? Uh, wait up. Are you Ransom or are you just some... Yeah. I think he's some asshole. Uh, let's see. Yeah, there was two free computers around here. <clears throat> Read, Snides, read this. What do you mean you shut the access door to the elevator? All your guns and supplies mean jack shit to me when the synthetic that was chasing you is still fucking down here. I don't think it's uh, seen me. It stood staring at your old magazines in the, uh, blood, in the blood plant overlook. Get back down here and open this door now. Okay, I think nice. it might be Smythe next to us. Or at the front. Yeah. I don't get how many of you are still around you know, to get this, but I've got weapons and supplies and I'm setting up shop outside the synthetic showroom. Oh, I'm hoping we'll be safe from the creature up here. Smythe is with me and I'm waiting to be let up from the fluid plant reception. I still haven't seen Suzanne. If you're, uh, if you're with her, let me know. I think this might be from Ransom then. Okay, also... Is, is, yeah. is it just me, or does it seem like there's more and more space between these now? Yeah, I mean, it is like... They're putting more one... space between them just to make sure you regret everything. Yeah. Between yeah, guys. It's a bit of a difficulty thing. Let's see. Like, the further you get in the game, the harder it gets. Yeah. And, yeah. Two of them didn't activate, so it was. When a new synthetic registered, attempted unauthorized access. Just in case. Yeah. And I just remember something. Hmm? I, think, I think there's another reason to why they made less of them uh, later on. I think it was due to uh, the testers ended up. Uh, Saving uh, in very bad situations. Yeah, where they'd get impaled the moment the save is done. Yeah. yeah apparently one of the alarms has gone dubstep. Okay. That's not kind of like uh, my old air fryer uh, as it was breaking down. <laughs> okay. That's why I bought a new one. Clutter clouds the mind. Clean workstation is clean. Uh, clear heads. Uh, okay, these two are reminding me of. Was it freaking Red Dwarf or something where that, that had just a, a an alien species of dickheads? Again, that that's literally the Xenomorphs. Should they add Red Wolf's Red Wolf as a thing to watch? Probably. I've I've only ever seen fragments. Uh, Same. I, but I do hear that it is freaking hilarious. Wait, yeah. they even renewed the season some the uh, season two some year ago. Okay. If I remember correctly, there's literally a joke where they fuck up the JFK assassination that fucks up the timeline. So they make it so JFK shoots him. So future JFK get, shoots himself in order to keep the timeline straight. Uh, and all of that happened because they literally. And all of that happened because they just wanted to get some curry. <laughs> oh, for love of. Uh, so it sounds a bit like Monty Python in space to me. Yeah. <laughs> well, it is yeah. British humor, so. Yeah. yeah. I like that I like that uh theory that the reason that the one who shot JFK was was this great future JFK simply because it fucks with people. Malfunctioning. And yes, for the record, I like it as a joke, not I don't subscribe to the JFK theories. Yeah. 
Uh, what is it about? What now? Well, mm -hmm. the thing's fucked. Yep. Again. Now it's just broken. Great, so we gotta go back to Zeke's then. Hmm. What is that about? I know they were basically decommissioned in this place and it's on the cheap, but come the fuck out of one goddamn thing that isn't completely falling apart in front of us. Yeah, it, it seems this place has been. It seems the only thing that's been built with fail saves has been the freaking elevators. Yeah. And even those fail to be safe. Yeah, I was just to say, didn't you have one that fell down and exploded? Yeah. <clears throat> Pardon? Yeah, okay, pardon. time to check the restore power. We need to... Okay, where the fuck are we going? You know what? Why don't we just use Rom's grenades? Okay, I love to give you some, but... Here. Um, we don't seem to be models. able to use them. The, the show models, the cans of potatoes. <laughs> I'd laugh if they were, but... Apparently, no, we can't use our my grenade for some reason. Okay, so we just mm. need to get across? What, is this a jumping puzzle? I'm pretty sure there's no jump in this game. Yeah, I've thought that there was multiple times, but nope. Oh, here. <laughs> Fucking hissing sounds. Oh. Okay, and we don't want to get to go across when those things are blasting. Yeah, probably. Wait for it. Uh, must. Okay, that must be freezing air because it chills. The met. Yeah. Okay, that's a, that's a very neat little detail. It visibly gets chilled right. and then thaws again. Is this one going to blast or not? Doesn't look like it. Oop. It said jump down, don't jump down on your face, Amanda. Wait for it. Those are some powerful ECs. Yeah, not an athlete, just a, a mechanic, so... Okay, well, with our year, year supply of parkour done, let's just move on. And Inx just keeps looking between the window and the door. I know something you don't. I'm not even remotely surprised. Behavioral orientation. We just have to find Apollo's core. Spending in Android processing. We've got a situation. There's white on red casualties on station. I've just had an Android report to the APTC with head trauma. But Wait. it's covered in blood. Human blood. I've alerted the marshals, put my secretary someplace safe, and right now I'm headed for the transit. No, I mean, there's a save point right behind you. Yeah. Okay, so that was... That, okay, that was sped, uh, spedding, not a Ransom. Okay. No, I think Ransom was the guy in the higher office. Spedding was the other guy. Hmm. And we did... We have been seeing... Okay, this is just a visual glitch. We have been seeing those uh, messages signed with S talking about Sinclair, so that was not Sinclair. That must be yeah. spelling them. Okay. Just shoot uh -oh. them. How do you miss at point blank range? Point blank? He hit him through the ear! But I, I still missed one shot. Yeah, that's what I meant. Mm. No. Nah. Yep. 
Yeah. Is this, is this just going to be a fucking conga line of these assholes now? You might want to reload. Yeah, it's tap and then hold to keep loading. Bit odd, but okay. Just a, a pile of blue man group rejects. <laughs> yeah, they're all the wrong color. The white men group? Ejector. Ah. Let's turn that camera off. I think I wrote a listen to, oh, what do you call it again? Backstreet Boys? No, Backstab Boys, my they been. Or... <laughs> yeah, the parody yeah. group. Now I'm okay, now I'm reminded of a Brooklyn Nine-Nine joke. Yeah. The tell me why joke. Like, they're doing a lineup of suspects. Oh, good. That guy's getting up. Get him again. One more. Yeah, I think there I like the back, backstab boys more. I got double shake, but that's what they called. It, it's basically Jason Voorhees, Freddy Krueger, Michael Myers, and I forgot the fourth. Be basically singing parodies of uh, boy bands uh, songs. Also, you yeah. only have one shot in the revolver. Yeah, but backstab boys could also be a name for just a D and D party that's only rogues. <laughs> oh dear. Actually, well, I think I said this before, but there is actually a Backstreet Boys reference in Warhammer Fantasy. Yay. Apparently, Skorsnik, before he became a warlord, used to be part of a group called Backstair Boys. Backstair right. Boys. Do yes. They, do they go upstairs backwards? Uh, I guess they ambush people on the stairs in the Dwarven Holds, or something. Mm. Again, they had many... No, they, they, outdated lore were even crazier, like... Some Viking had a... Viking ship called the Volkswagen. <laughs> oh, yes. Uh, where's the rewire here? And again, also that bloody heck, yeah, I think I said this before, the no, most rewire. weirdest characters in the old, old, old 40k lore. The, probably the first name Inquisitor. Let's see, Obi-Wan, Sherlock, Chateau Holmes, something. <laughs> really? Yeah, he has a long name, and a name. Long... yeah, that's what his name. It's still unknown if he's still canon. Good. Okay, there we have it. Ink is laying over my arm, or over my hand, with her head on my hand as well. I'm just going to make a quick photo of this and send it to you two. With one hand? Yes. Uh, that looks like a pie. <clears throat> okay, there, discords. Yeah, she, she has her claw. <laughs> she has her paws on my finger now, and she's already pushing my eh, my arm aside so my hand is diagonal on the <laughs> keyboards. Uh, there. Yeah. And now she's sitting back up again because she needs to lick her back for some reason or another. Yeah, I want to see around. a picture of uh, a glass bowl with pie. Oh, wait, is Inky a pie? No, it's in stream talk now. Ah, uh, okay. Hmm. Okay, at least I can have my hand in a more natural Ripley, position now. Good to see you alive. Apollo's security perimeter has been built so that only Sikhs and synthetics can interact with it. Listen to me. I'm going to have to do something rather drastic if I hope to connect with Apollo. Chat. Oh, great. 
Something drastic or something stupid. Yes. Okay, that's adorable. I'm going to use the reformat chamber. It's the only option. I've had to divert power from the area to allow me to try. Really, you're going to format yourself? Like, what part of formats, if meaning delete everything, do you not get? Like, even if that would work, you would not know you were what why you were trying to do it again. Also, well, wouldn't there just be hardware incompatibility or something? Samuels, that's too dangerous. Yes, far too dangerous. Wish me luck. Samuels, don't. We'll do not want to step into that. That's probably liquid, the liquid nitrogen, and not liquid nitrogen. Liquid nitrogen, really? Now I've missed a boat, let us say. Liquid. Apollo, infection has been purged. The creature is no longer on board. The station is safe. Request that all hazard containment operations are suspended. Oh, uh, yeah, he's trying to connect. He's trying to communicate through that. You might want to check the cables. Which one's the red one? The red cable first. Okay, red first. Okay. No, nope. time to time to save our supposed supercomputer of a companion. There. I, we can technically just check these <laughs> where they end because. Well, Blue disconnect. There, there. What next? I'm having trouble accessing the schematics. And Apollo is making things difficult. I need the next one, Samuels! Yep. What? What's happening out there, Ripley? The emergency lights have come on! I can't make out the colors of the cables! You're gonna have to guide me to them! The next one is plugged into a wall socket. There was an upturned gurney nearby. This one. Hopefully. Now there's freaking alarms as well. Oh, good luck that androids have a photo <laughs> photographic memory then, huh? Because these are both open. Oh yeah, let's get you the fuck out of there. That place is burning up. Yep. Okay, how in haven't we gotten electrocuted from this yet? Pure luck. Yeah, this is what they're talking about, the EA people. Ricardo, if you're there, pick up. I'm here. I'm here. Sorry. Samuels is gone. Shit. He opened Apollo Transit for me. I'm gonna go straight there. I'll get Apollo to lift the lockdown. Uh, but yeah, people, this is what I mean that this is we've been fighting. They have an intelligence, but it's more very work based. 
Samuel is the one with the... Uh... Yeah, but we mean the uh, higher intelligence and all that. And self-awareness. Yeah. They are closer to human than the, these uh, synthetic here. Or than the working Joes, yeah. I forget yeah. if it's... I forget which word it is for self-awareness. Sentience or sapience? Because they are not the same. I have no idea. I think it's sentient. That seems to be the word people use. And let me do a quick Google on the side here as we run back through all of this. Yeah, but I think we can agree. There are many words that have been used very wrong over the years. Dude. Almost walked right into this fucker. Got no that... extra shells. A little bit too close. Okay, let's see. Dictionary definition. Wise or attempting to appear wise. Uh, uh, okay. Full of knowledge, wise. Okay, and what is sentient then? Yep, of course, that's the next one. Able to perceive or feel things. Okay. I already heard, heard that. Can we skip that somehow? White on red, blood color. Android on human. Islands. of the planetoid where you found the derelict. All data you have on the origin of that organism. I can give you that. And a way off this station. You just have to let me out. I can probably agree to those terms. What the fuck? Taylor? Taylor, get me out of the cell right now! Get me out! Fucking Taylor. Leave it to the fucking lawyer. I heard it. Nope. Okay, so that's how Marlo got out. I, I, I'm guessing they just bailed the fuck out whilst the androids were busy choking out everyone else. There we go. Apollo, private transit available. Or, or Apollo. Okay, let's go talk with a rogue AI then. See if we can charisma check our way out of this bullshit. Or at the very least, blob the AI and just leave. Blob? Blow up. Oh, blow up, okay. One of these days I'm going to pay to get your ears checked. I told you, I have a very strong hearing. But strong hearing doesn't mean it's, uh, doesn't mean it's uh, perfect. He has many downsides, I have a strong hearing. Okay. Ink, now Ink is just loafing next to my arm. Raise the loaf. Turning to a loaf. Only actually, yeah, where you're looking. Can Oxes, the cats, owls. You're on the floor mm. above the Apollo core. This whole area contains Apollo supportive systems with the AI core itself at the center. Apollo prevented Samuels from lifting the lockdown remotely, but once you're inside, he made sure it'll at least talk to you. 
Okay, an audience with a mad AI. That totally won't get creepy and existential. Okay. I think we saw that before. I've come over to Apollo to find out what set the synthetics crazy. This place has gone to hell. Apollo's redirected core android duties, and they've just walked away from the maintenance we requested after we got the news. Coolants everywhere, gas has escaped, and the primary access lift has shut itself down. I flagged a help request, but apparently I'm 45th in line. Systems are suddenly obsessed with hazard containment. I'm gonna find a way down. Spreading out. Okay, and with hazard containment, they mean the xenomorph. There, there, and there. Okay. Anything else we can craft? No, we're full up on everything. Okay. There we go. Okay, but what would an AI want with a Xenomorph? Mm. Yeah, it could be fascination since, well, it, okay, <laughs> laying her head on my, uh, yeah, on my, the Fire hand again. Detected. You've got to be shitting me. Great. I'll bet. One of the firearms a bit more livable than the others. But yeah. Uh, AIs have had fascinations with quote unquote perfect organisms before. So. Yeah, we're, pro we're probably not getting those back. Ricardo, the way in's blocked off. The schematics they use for the Sevastopol sales tour should be nearby. See if there's a back door. Okay, sales tour schematics. They're so supposed to be around here. Okay. Can I hope we find a save station soon since I just looked at the clock? Yeah. When we get to the next one, Wait. actually, there's one right there. Ah, oh, uh, there. there. Okay, four or yeah, four nine, nine for you. Okay, let's see. There's a power conduit that links to the Apollo core. I can use that. You think you'll fit? Turn off the electrics, take some deep breaths, squeeze. Easy. I'm not coming up there to pull you out if you get stuck. There. Huddling up to a live conduit is gonna hurt though, right? I'll have to power it down first. Okay. Uh, that's where we'll have to leave it for today, though. Before yeah. my hand goes completely numb from ink just laying on it. Yeah, and again... Uh, on all the games we will continue, but since these things are getting rarer and rarer... Yeah. Yeah, we kind of have to be a bit cautious. Okay, so yeah, that'll be it for... Yep. What do you what what do you keep reacting to, Ink? Also, I'm a, I'm a bit amazed she hasn't bumped into any of the keys yet. <clears throat> but yeah, that'll be it for Alien Isolation. And yeah, I swapped out the background for the other one. Uh, no real reason, <laughs> really. I don't. I should probably patch up that dash across the eye there. Yes, it is AI. And yes, I am looking to get it replaced. <clears throat> by paying a friend of mine. Any artists in the chat or seeing this later? No, not taking any, <laughs> not going to take any commissions with you. Because plainly, I, did, <laughs> I don't trust any, you know, I, uh, yeah, like I said, <clears throat> I don't trust anyone I don't know with it. Okay. Uh, let me pause that for the clip later. And let's have a look at who are online. Okay, it is very, very busy at the moment, okay. So October, let me narrow this down. Let's see. We have Frank Fro, who is playing The Legend of Zelda. Uh, which was it again? Yeah, Echoes of Wisdom, the newest one, isometric. I haven't heard, I haven't heard too much of it. I have seen a lot of advertisements on it. 
but I haven't heard much on if it's good or bad, but it is Zelda. And well, with a very few exceptions, they've all been good games at the at the least. Uh, you, then we have... You about the 3DOs ones that were bad? Yeah. <laughs> uh, next we have Graham the Wolf, who is playing Darkwood. And I need to check that sometime. Let's see. <laughs> Last but not least, we have Lasherus with Grim Dawn. Any of those sound of interest, or shall I take a pick? You take a pick. I'm gonna go ahead and leave. I'll see you guys later. Okay. Okay. For some reason, ink just bolted. Not just oh, bolted there, but first across, and then. Sleep well, oh, Rom. <laughs> see you next time, Rom. <clears throat> uh, okay. Yeah. I got a little heal this side says bloody heck tell you this just slammed a hammer on my head. Okay, Metaphorically. Let me take a quick peek. It has been forever since we've raided Grim, I think. So let's actually go say hi, since well they're also playing a fitting game. Okay, copy what? the name. Slash yeah. red and paste. <laughs> but Sorry. Yeah, actually need to turn off the interference button. And yeah, let's see. Uh, no stream on Saturday because I have work then. Or very unlikely to have a stream at least. So Sunday we continue with the Dark Side Detective, a fumble in the dark. And yeah, yeah. we'll continue with this game next week on Tuesday, if possible. Yeah, oh, I should process it is. We will try on next week with multiplayer Saturday. Yeah. But if we can't, we may. It depends on the situation. Do a bonus stream of Dark Side Detective. Yeah, because I get the feeling we're probably going to be la uh, taking quite a bit longer than uh, <laughs> October with that, if it comes to it. Yeah. <clears throat> uh, but yeah, I think that's about it. So, yeah. <clears throat> uh, thank you, everyone who's watching now or later. Thank you, Mettler. And I see Jess and Knight have been <laughs> lurking in chat. So hi, you two. And Hello. yeah, thank you as always, Ram and Drakir. You're welcome as always, my friend. And sleep well, everyone. And watch out for Cinemorphic Seagulls. Uh, also, I, I'm just going to point this out in case nobody's noticed yet, but uh, Drakir's Xenomorph head is also wearing the helmet. <laughs> yep, I just realized I butchered what I was just about to say. That I should say the favorite part later. <laughs> yeah, let's see. Night. Uh, yes, hello. I was out of looking. I've been tired after my six, seven days of constant lore writing, and now it's finally done. I'm looking. You don't need to put that much effort into it now. It's, it's take rests when you need and such. But yeah, thanks for looking. And yeah, let's get this raid started. And. Yeah, thank you all again for watching, and until next time, have a nice day, and until then. Yes, everyone, sleep well, and again, watch out for xenomorphic seagulls. And uh, rogue androids and AI. Oh, dear. <laughs> <laughs>